All aboard the Heavy Duty Express! hope everybody's having a great day um y'all i missed y'all so much i'm so glad to be back we finna start doing the damn thing and i hope i don't never miss that miss that much time in between the video again ever so um thank y'all once again for coming aboard the heavy duty express where we're always blessed never stressed and as y'all know i'm always a mess come on like a chat for me yes i one more time Comment like a share for me. And if anybody's new to the channel, if you would, run over hit the subscribe button. Then hit the notification bell select all. That way every time we upload a video or go live, you get a notification you come check us out. Y'all, I'm going to go ahead and pray. And I'll tell you what this good looking stuff is. Our Heavenly Father, we come before you at this time to thank you for this day, Lord. We thank you for all the blessings that you bestowed upon us. Lord, we ask you to bless this meal for the nourishment of our body. We ask you to forgive us our sins and our shortcomings. We ask all these things in your son Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. Yum, yummy. I'm talking about yum, yum, yummy. We got some corn on the cob. We got some baked pork chop. And we got a new specialty that I, I learned from a friend of mine that uh, where I was just at for the past almost two weeks. Um, some bacon-wrapped green beans. You take it and wrap Fresh green beans, whole green beans, in bacon, just one like one little half a strip, and then put um, um, brown sugar, sprinkle brown sugar over it, and bake it in the oven for about I don't know, maybe twenty minutes. I think they was in there, a lot, just long enough to cook the bacon. And boy, oh boy, them jokers are good. So uh, I'm gonna get eating, y'all. Finna get eating. That's the first thing I'm gonna try. Y'all wanna bite? And or you put a toothpick through it to hold it to hold the bacon together. Get that a little closer for y'all. Oh, yum yum. Mmm. Oh, good. Not quite as good as my buddy Dom, but they're good. Mmm. <laughs> Yum, yum. Come on, Cobb. Go on, bite. Mmm. Went to Walmart today. Turn the plate around here. Got some ears of corn. I shook that stuff myself. <laughs> Well, I should have got me a knife, y'all, so excuse me. Mmm. That is so good. Mmm. Y'all, drink on a Bud Light tonight, y'all. A little something. Just one. So how has everybody been doing? Y'all, I hope y'all been doing great. I know for those of you who don't know, um, Lady Boss is starting her own channel. It's called Lady Boss Doing Her Thing. Um, in fact, I think she's doing a live tonight. Of course, I mean, y'all won't see this till tomorrow. So, if y'all are watching the live tonight, then y'all already know, huh? <laughs> I know she put a community post up on Heavy Duty Express. So, I don't know how many people seen it and how many people 
have commented on it. And I, think, I think it was like five comments on it when I looked earlier. Mm. Oops. There I go. Me doing good. Or me doing me. Making a mess. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Up there where I was staying at. Well, my buddy. I think we might have had two actual real meals the whole time I was there. Most of the time it was just sandwiches and and stuff and and I didn't have a I didn't have a place to set up to do videos at down there. So I am glad to be where I can do a video cuz I've been missing Missing doing it, missing y'all, missing everything about it, y'all. And a quick little shout out to my brother Lips. What's up, brother? Mm. So, one thing I do know. Is I lost a couple pounds while I was down there. Or something. Had to have. Because like I said. Well, I, only had like, I only had like two real actual sit down meals. While I was down there. Most of them were just sandwiches and stuff. But. Not eating like I was. Like I would, like I've been doing on the channel. I think my stomach done shrunk up a little bit. Cause I ain't gonna lie. I'm starting to get a little full. And I ain't ate nothing since this morning. Mm. I should have got me two things of corn. But. I'll be alright. Why am I why am I why am I saying I should got two? <laughs> when I I know I ain't gonna be able to hold it. Mmm. I hope this thing is awesome. I didn't put as much brown sugar on it as he told me to because my mother and grandmother are diabetic, so I couldn't put a lot on there. So. But they're still good. I do recommend y'all try them if you want to. I mean, it's just a little quick, easy recipe. I'll put it in the description box. And the caboose. Mmm. Oh, yes, sir. Mm. <clears throat> Excuse me. Muck burp, y'all. Excuse me. So sorry. Mm. Uh oh. I about lost the rest of it, y'all. That would have been. A, I would have cried over that mess. <laughs> almost there about one or two more good bites of course one or two more good bites off the pork chop it'd be gone they wasn't them little, little thin ones but they, they packing a good punch to my tummy <laughs> no come on like that for me and if you're new to the channel if you would run over hit the subscribe button then hit the notification bell select all that way every time we upload a video or go live 
you get a notification, you come check us out. Yo! Ooh, we. I know tomorrow night. I think I'm, I'm, I'm gonna try to do the. Try to do the karaoke live on Tuesday night, like it's supposed to be this week, instead of Wednesday night. But, um, I will put a community post up tomorrow to let y'all know for sure. Because, <coughs> excuse me, I still hadn't tested out the laptop to the Wi-Fi to see how, how good of service is going to pick up. So, ooh, excuse me. Mm. Well, that's gone. Yeah, I think I'm about done. I'm going to take one more bite off of this pork chop. I mean, true. True, y'all. Over it. Over it. 430. Done. Stick a fork in me. <laughs> okay. That is all she wrote on that subject. Y'all ready for the daily bread? I know I am. I mean, I've been reading it, reading it every day, but not to y'all. Let's see here. Uh, yeah, I could use a thousand dollars today. <laughs> Let's see daily bread. Today is January the 11th, 2021. Um, today's title is Lift Up Your Eyes. The reading comes from Psalms 121. It says up at the top, My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. That's Psalms 121 verse 2. It says, The clouds hung low blocking the horizon, and limiting visibility to only a few hundred yards. The minutes dragged on. The effect of my mood was noticeable. But then, as afternoon approached, the clouds began to break, and I saw it. Beautiful Pikes Peak, the most recognizable landmark of my city, flanked on each side by the mountain range. A smile broke over my face. I considered that even our physical perspective, our literal line of sight, can affect our spiritual vision. And I was reminded of the psalmist singing, I lift up my eyes to the mountain. That's Psalms 121 verse 1. Sometimes we simply need to lift our eyes a bit higher. The psalmist powered, uh, pondered whether his help where his help came from. Maybe because the hilltops around Israel were dotted with altars to pagan gods and often contained robbers. Or it could have been because the psalmist looked up beyond the hills to Mount Zion where the temple stood and remembered that the maker of heaven and earth was his covenant, or was his covenant God. Either way, to worship, we must look up. We have to lift our eyes higher than our circumstances, higher than our troubles and trials, higher than the empty promises of the false gods of our day. Then we can see the Creator and Redeemer, the one who calls us by name. He's the only He's the one who will watch over your coming and going today and forevermore. I couldn't agree with that more. I mean, you just have to remember that no matter where we are, God sees us. And all the, all the miraculous things that he's done, that's, I like that today. Reflect and pray for today, says, Dear Father, Thank you that you're the creator and keeper, the one who made the heavens and the earth and watches over me. 
Help me to lift my eyes higher to see you and to put my trust in you. Always, forever, amen. Help me to lift my eyes to, to a higher level to be able to see you. Because God is creator, maker of all the heavens and earth. Every one of us. Um, and we need to thank him every day for that. Because if it wasn't for him, wouldn't none of us be here, y'all. Well, y'all, I'm full. I am fizzing to wash up some dishes, clean up my mess where I cooked, and upload this video. So, y'all, comment like a share for me. And if you're new to the channel, if you would, run over to the subscribe button. Then hit the notification bell, select all. That way, every, every time we upload a video or go live, you get a notification and come check us out. But y'all, we love you. And thank y'all once again for coming aboard the Heavy Duty Express, where we're always blessed, never stressed, and I'm always a mess. And uh, may y'all stay blessed, never stressed, and try to, stay, try, to, little, little, try to stay out of a mess. But if you do get one, always remember, call on the good Lord, he'll help you through it. If you want to believe. But yeah. I'm done. I'm an OV. I'm out of here, y'all. We love y'all. And we'll see you next time. Um, like I said, live should be tomorrow night. I'll put up a community post. I'll let you know for sure. And um, hopefully we'll see y'all then. Bye-bye. Love you. Mwah. Peace. Hi, right, y'all. Hey, I forgot. Uh, the caboose, I told y'all I was going to do the, um, put the recipe for the bacon-wrapped green beans in the caboose. So, it's, it's just a little simple recipe. You take, um, a strip of bacon, take three or four fresh green beans before you not cut, just fresh ones. Um, and take them and wrap it in bacon, stick a toothpick through it, and sprinkle um, whatchamacallit, and sprinkle brown sugar on it, and stick it in the oven for like, well, just long enough for the bacon to get done, and boy, oh boy, like I said, I couldn't put much on, on these, because, um, my, uh, I said my mother and my grandmother are diabetic, so they can't have much sweet stuff, you know what I'm saying, so I had to limit the brown sugar that I put on these, but they still turned out pretty good. Thumbs up to my buddy Roger for introducing me to this recipe. I will be doing it again. Thank you, brother. But y'all, we love y'all. Y'all stay safe, stay blessed. And till next time, we love you. Mwah. If y'all want to go back and read, oh, well, I, I gotta refer, re, read to reflect and pray first, y'all, huh? What's up, what's up, what's up, passengers? How y'all doing today? It's your boy, Heavy Duty. I'm back, y'all. Hey, I have missed y'all so much. I'm glad, glad, glad to be back. Y'all, um, if you're new to the channel, if you would, run over and hit the subscribe button. Then hit the notification bell, select all. That way, every time we upload a video or go live, you get a notification and come check us out. And thank you once again for coming aboard the Heavy Duty Express, where we're always blessed, never stressed, and I'm always a mess. I got to start over. I had a fan going, dang it. <sighs> what's up, what's up, what's up, passengers? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Okay, whatever. <laughs>